it's the Giants who win possession. Saviano forward he goes across to Shields and scores! Colin Shields opens the scoring for the Belfast Giants this evening to the bench and the Giants go back to full strength. Here come the Stars, Stadel in a good position, shoots and scores! Riley Stadel, the first goal of the season for the Dundee Stars. It's one each with 14.31 to go in the second period. Quick. Dickin. Try to put off uh, Matau there. No joy, and the Giants move forward again. Matau in close, and that is across the line. Connolly gives the Giants their lead back. We'll knock this across. Chance here for Stadel. Back to Hrenic, moving this around the zone. Down low into the corner for Levesque and back around for Hrenic. Comes across. Chance here. Scores for the Stars. 26 seconds remaining in this game and it's an equalising goal. Adam Harding equalises for the Stars. Here we go then, the first shot. It's Connolly across the line, moves in down the centre, shoots that one and that is a save across the pond. Here we go, it's Stadel. Takes this one across to the right, moves well out and back in down the centre, whistle out to meet. Stadel scores! Here he goes, takes it across to the right as well, and he comes on Fullerton, down the middle, tries to fake one, Fullerton had it covered, saw it coming for the Stars. Field goes quickly to the left, comes in now, shoots one, whistle with a blocker save. Oh. Who else is Colin Shields? Franchise leader for the Giants and all sorts of facts and figures. Here he is now. And Dundee starts live, about to take this penalty shot to keep the Giants in this one. Here he comes, down the centre he goes. Keeping a close eye on this one is Travis Fulton. Fulton makes the save. And there we go. The Stars take the win. The first competitive game of the season. from the fan they're really causing some early problems on Manchester Storm. Hopefully more to continue. And Bjorklund picks it up from the clan now. Along the blue line. Finn Dem back top of the slot. It's in! Finn Dem back! Open to scoring! It's a power play goal for the Brayhead clan! Only eight seconds into that power play! Clan with a nice clean draw! Well not yet, no. I think it's been a bit of a rush start. Clan using the speed they've got in their team to great effect so far, it's causing them problems, Storm not really settling into the game. Sullivan sent it in from the point, it's a rebound! Oh, it's Dotty! Jacob Dotty took the rebound! Clark looking really comfortable, with just 12 seconds left! The Storm win the draw cleanly, and it's Becker picking it up in his own zone. Goes diagonally across the ice, Becker makes the entry, holds it off, flashes the shot in, nice here! And it's a goal for Storm! Four on four goal for Manchester Storm! I think it might have been Hammond as well who got the goal. Any earlier, as they play Belfast in their game. Anyway, it's all about this one. One, two, Storm one! It's a shot from Bissonnette. Just on the inside right, had a look up. Next thing you know. One, two, Storm two in the first period. 5.23 left to go. Man defending it once again. On another penalty kill at the moment. As Christopher Bjorkland sits for interference, Bissonnette. Nice to keep it in the clan zone, it's Becker on the right side. Oh, it's played well, into the centre, it's well worked. Becker again with another assist as the Storm go 3-2. And Haywood on this near side in the neutral zone, clan coming forward again. Then back in the centre. Drives on, what a shot from Mike Enbach, takes it over the blue line. Has a look up, what a spot, just over the shoulder of Mike Clemente. On this near side, this just has to... Yes, it is. They're sporting a beard nowadays. And back. Yeah, it is. It's back and in for first range. Wow. By Jacob Dotty. That's a wonderful finish in the right place at the right time. Pan 28. Swipes it into the net. 4-3. There's a much bigger sheet of ice up here at Brayhead. 
That goes against him. Swindlehurst has a big hit, and the rebound is popped in by Bars. Wonderful stuff. Just as I was talking there, the puck came to Swindlehurst. He took a big one-timer. Can the Storm make use of those extra skaters? Although the big bodies be tired also. Storm, pick up the puck. It's open up with the saw. Oh, a second shot! To the Storm Clans lead! Brendan Brooks turns on the afterburners. Has Grace in the center. It's Oslansky actually in the center. Raise the challenge. Snowbrooks. Snowbrooks looks for the support. Drops it off. Certainly does, but Storm still remain camped in that clan zone. Hammond plays it away to Becker. Becker plays oh, it in. It's snuck in. Manchester get one back. That six skater has paid off. It looks like Becker was. It is open indeed. Clemente returns to the ice. Luke Moffat tries to scramble it in. Now it's Clyde has a chance. The fans are on their feet here. Here it comes for Adam Grace. An open goal. And Still nil-nil though, 4.39 left to go in this, the first period. Boise gives it away, it's Hammond, it's a goal for Manchester Storm. Hammond taking it off the stick of Boise as he looked to clear things behind the net. In will turn round, he makes his way back into the D-line, change for Manchester Storm. And two Storm players taking each other out there. Much to the pleasure of the Bladehead clans to, uh, to our left. And it has made it into the net somehow. The Storm fans don't seem, the uh, Storm players don't seem to be very happy about it. Started off very brightly this season as well. Cross ice pass. Flick back, what a great goal that is. The bottle pops and flies off the top of the net. And with 5.56 of the second period, Manchester Storm look to get it across the long in front of the crease. Too many clan bodies in the way though. Good pressure this from Manchester. And once again, good defence from Brayhead. Long once again in the corner, sliding challenge comes in across the zone. And it is... I'm not sure if that went straight in off the post or if it got a deflection on the far side of the goal. But it... And now we're battling along the boards in the corner. I can see Swindlehurst in there, I can see Oslansky in there, Brendan Brooks also in there. Trying to get it free, trying to get it clear. Here comes Gerard Hansen. He's out. Looking to find it. Rose Hill, empty netter. And the Storm Shelter goes wild. 2.29.